Hey guys, it's Rain, and look at what I got in the mail today. Uh, it's been a while since I've been able to do an Art Cal bead order. It's also been a while since I've been able to do any um, Art Cal or Pearly bead projects because for a while I actually couldn't find the box that all of my supplies were in. I did find it, so um, I can go ahead and I can do more um, Art Cal tutorials and uh, possibly maybe some live streams of just working on some projects and stuff like that. So let's go ahead, we'll open it up and see what's inside. I did one of their, uh, I think it was like six packages for $30 or something like that. It was one of their deals that they have going on on the website right now. I did request certain colors, but I'm not sure if my request went through when the order went through. So it could be the colors I asked for, or it could be something completely different. Now, last time they sent a little piece of plastic that you iron with. I do not see one in there this time. Last time I accidentally cut it, so that's why I was trying to be careful. So let's see what's inside. Oh, so I didn't get one of these last time. Yeah, so it's just a little booklet. It has all of Art Cal's social media accounts and everything like that. And it has like a little thank you inside and whatnot with some uh, I guess coupons and whatnot. That's pretty neat. Wow, there are so many in here. All right. So, dump them in, see what we got. So it looks like I did get the colors that I wanted. So I got two different shades of yellow. I got two different shades of purple. A dark gray, which is a color that I actually haven't seen in Perler, which is pretty nice um, to have different shades of gray. Um, I guess it's like a peachy type color. I got a red a white and two very close shades of orange. Uh, so just in case you guys wanted to know what uh, the color codes are, so we have C05 and of course C01 for white, C16, C17, that's C92, but the purples here are C26 and C50. C34 for the darker gray. And then for the two different yellows, we have C10 and C11. Um, I initially wanted the darker gray um, for some of the characters that I've been doing that have had a lot of black in them. So instead of doing just black, um, I wanted to do like gradients of gray, which is why I got the darker gray. Um, I got the oranges and the red um, to make fire Pokemon because I made a lot of the, the starter Pokemon, but I couldn't make um, Charmander, Charmeleon, or Charizard because I didn't have any of the darker reds or the oranges. So I can make those now, which is super exciting. I am so happy for that. Um, and then I was running out of white, so I needed to get white. And I wanted to get a couple more shades of purple. Um, I think next time I want to try and get some more shades of pink because I am running out of pink. But um, I thought that this would be enough for now because I am a poor starving artist. <laughs> But I thought that uh, I could replenish some of my stocks, so I did. Um, if you guys are interested 
in knowing the art cow beads actually work really well with the perler beads and I'm actually preferring art cow beads because they come in more colors which is really nice for um, a whole bunch of different projects that I've been doing um, so as you can see there's like a lot of different projects that people do uh, which is pretty darn cool. I do a lot of Pokemon. I do a lot of Overwatch. I do a lot of Undertale. Um, for the most part, I think that's it. I've done a little bit of Sailor Moon um, bead art as well. And I want to try and branch it and do like some more um, like do Digimon and Five Nights at Freddy's. But yeah, um, so look forward to some live streams, look forward to some Perler Beat videos, some tutorials. If you guys have any questions about um, Perler Beating or I guess, I don't know what else you call it, pixel art, please let me know in the comments below uh, if you have any requests for characters that you would like to see done in pixel art or Perler art. Please let me know, and if you like my videos, please give me a thumbs up, please subscribe, and I will see you guys later.